He, I mean, he is a very vivacious, very curious, you know, very smart little boy. Ah, ah. Um, but he becomes ill so frequently, and when he does become ill, it's it's very, it can be life threatening. You ready to go It is unbelievable. It's overwhelming. It's you don't know what to do. They want to do this test. They want to do that test. And you think when you first hear it and what they're looking for, it's it's wonderful. You're thinking, okay, great. We're we're gonna figure out what it is. We're gonna fix it, and he's gonna be okay. Crocodile. They say snap. 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 My first impression of Shabri was a parent who had been very independent. Um, she now had a child who was probably having a life-threatening episodes, which um, have now been diagnosed as probably an immune deficiency disorder. Um, we have unplanned and unscheduled doctor's visits that come up. At the beginning of the month, I looked at this month and said, okay, we've got three scheduled appointments. Well, that turned into so far two last week and two this week, so we're at four. Um, she finally had to quit her job to stay at home with Cody. Um, family had seen some of the episodes and were unable to watch him. Um, so she basically had to start staying at home to be there with Cody. You know, we're hoping, of course, that she could get some reliable transportation. It's difficult to take Cody to his doctor's appointments, which are frequent, um, because of the unreliability of her car. It's due for inspection this month, and I'm not sure that it'll pass, but the main problem with it right now is the transmission. It's slipping and leaking. I've been nursing it along for quite a while, but I I'm afraid that it's not gonna last much longer. Right now, the best that I can hope for is to try to find some income that I can do at home while I'm caring for him. Um, at least enough that I can support him. If not for the distraction of being so overwhelmed with his health and his medical needs and dealing with the doctors and all that, I, I, I guess I've been able to use that as an escape not to have to think about and, and deal with what I feel is, is um, yeah. kind of having failed him. <laughs>